G'day everyone. This is Jill, also known as Jeannie Oz from the land down under, Australia. And I'm here at the final day of Roots Tech. The voice is going, but the enthusiasm's still hot. I've grabbed a mate of mine, Dirk from Germany, who I've met at a few Roots Techs, but I don't really know much about Dirk and I'd like to know who he is and why he comes to Roots Tech. Dirk, why are you here at Roots Tech? Well, I'm here to see what is uh, the latest development in genealogy on the mm -hmm. international level. And mm -hmm. it is just the right place to do that because this is the, well, let's say the uh, central point in the world because Roots Tech is the biggest genealogy event worldwide. I call it the greatest genius show on earth. So, Dirk, you must be a professional genealogist. You work in Germany. Uh, no, I'm no? not a no. I'm not a professional genealogist. You're an amateur I'm like the, me. Well, I'm I'm the national chairman of the genealogical societies in Germany, mm -hmm. and so I'm very much interested in to get to know uh, what is uh, genealogy in other uh, okay. parts of the world done. So you're. Is it an umbrella body? The yes, it is an umbrella organisation. Yeah, groups. it is the Society of Societies, so to say. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Uh, we have got uh, 67 members at uh, the moment, and uh, it is altogether more than 22,000 mm -hmm. people that are active in those societies. In so, are they organised according to geographical locations? Uh, Local government areas, uh, well, or, well, we or have, do they we spring have, up? Well, we have different forms of yeah. those societies uh, that have uh, developed differently. Mm -hmm. uh, so uh, you might have societies that are located in a city and just covering up that city, but mm -hmm. you also uh, might find different societies that cover up a whole county or even a, a German state. And, so. and could you have a society like um, a Jewish? Genealogy society. Yes, uh, we, or we don't have it now, Anglo but it, yes. Yes. now yes. we don't have it at the moment. But that is that is very possible. Yes, or yes, DNA yes, genealogists yeah, or something well, like that. Well, DNA is not that what it is here yeah, in America. Uh, yeah. it, is, it is not that big. And why is it that well, I would say people that, in Europe aren't taking yeah, up I, I, DNA? I know. I, I don't know about the Australian people, but I see here uh, what the Americans do, and they are very, very optimistic and enthusiastic mm. uh, towards DNA. Uh, I guess it comes from, of course, finding uh, the relationship uh, to, to back to Europe, uh, mm. mostly. Uh, maybe it is uh, that the Germans are, have an easier way to, to the resources to do genealogy. The Americans may not. So they think that um, DNA testing is the right uh, tool to do that. Uh, I would say the Germans are a little bit skeptical on skeptical, that. Skeptical, huh? Yes, uh, because we don't share this this great uh, optimism of the Americans <laughs> to put all these data together. So your personal data, your health data, uh, your social data, then DNA and on the top genealogy, mm. put it all in a bowl, just turn it around, say, <laughs> hi, this is just perfect. Now we can profile a person, person. a whole family yeah. or, or the ancestor. We are, we are quite uh, critical on that. Well, I believe you're coming to Australia. When you come to Australia, you will discover that we're probably even <laughs> more enthusiastic well, well, than, than the Americans. It's, you know, <laughs> well, <I'm, laughs> anything goes down under. Oh, is so, it? Yes. Is it? Well, I mean, I heard about your census. Yes. Uh, census, it, it wasn't yeah. that as no. you expected, isn't it? No. So it doesn't work yeah. uh, in, no, no, in no, every no. dimension. No. Yeah. So coming back to Roots Tech, yeah. uh, what particular aspect of Roots Tech do you enjoy? What is it the people? Is it the lectures? Are the um, keynotes? The you know, exhibitors? I wouldn't, I, I, wouldn't, I wouldn't say that I can have a priority on that. I mean, the, the mixture. I mean, oh, you know that. I mean, well, yeah. you, I mean, you know, that is, you, you know, it is the people, of course. It is uh, yeah. what is coming up in technology. Uh, then uh, what kind of projects are going on? Mm -hmm. And, and this, mix, this mixture uh, makes it so fantastic uh, that you can meet people from other places, from other countries, from other continents, actually. Mm -hmm. And then to, well, let's say, actually learn from each other. That brings me here, and I'm very proud to lecture here, to mm -hmm. inform people oh, about Germany. I noticed you were on the yes, program. Yes, Was it social media? You were... Uh, yes, kind of, but, you're, but you're... I, I give uh, lectures on, well, how genealogy is done in, 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 uh, in Germany. So and, and I see many, many people that are very interested in learning mm. about their German ancestors. Yes, well, the USA is like Australia. We're such a melting pot mm -hmm. uh, with people mm -hmm. from I all see. cultures and all yeah, countries. I it's see. good. I believe we'll get a plug-in for this. I believe you're coming down under to meet some of my friends and lecture in Australia. Well, I mean, it would be one of the most motivations, of course, to meet you there. Yes. Um, no, I, I, I would come uh, to Australia in August. In 2017, August, yes. yes. 
And you're going to a few cities? Yes, I will be in some of your biggest cities in Australia and uh, we'll lecture on German I know genealogy. you're coming to Sydney, my hometown. Yeah, I'm, I'm looking forward to do that because <laughs> I've, I've never been there and so it is a dream of mine. It, 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 yes. It's beautiful. It's beautiful. I, now, Dirk, you have a daytime job. Pardon? You have a job in the daytime? Yes, of course. You, a yeah. real work? Yeah, no, in... I'm, yeah I'm, not, I'm, I'm not a professional so genealogist. What, 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 what do you do well, in your I'm real Well, I'm a consultant on management, so this mm -hmm. is, that is uh, we earn my money, but genealogy is the topic of my life, of it's, course. I mean, I have American cousins here. I research on my surname and other surnames worldwide, so this is what... Are you doing me. a surname study? Yes, but, yeah, but, but what you call a surname study. study. Yes, a one mm -hmm. name or a surname study. study. Yes, yes. yes. Oh, yeah. good. And For do you have a website? For more than 30 years. I guess I have my own blog. It's www.forum-familiengeschichte.de. It's a I German word. It's a very long word. I don't think we could manage to spell that. I could manage to spell that out. But the people will find out. Forum-familiengeschichte.de. It's, it's um, um, yes. possible to find. It's, oh, it's and, and not everything is written in German. It is also written in English. Sometimes. That's good. Yes. Your English is very good. Oh, thank you very much, ma'am. No, I, I doubt it, but... I'm learning, I'm learning, yes. <laughs> I, I think your English has improved so much over the years that I, I've, I like I've that got language. to know you. So are you coming back to Roots Tech next year? Oh, uh, well, we will uh, see. I don't know. You know, it, it is always making plans nice. and uh, being in both houses of the parliament with your family. So yes. You must <laughs> so you get have a family, do you? Yes. Uh, yes, I'm married having two kids and so, you know, it needs you more than leave. just your wife to arrange all that. And yes. I, I'm very... I'm very grateful very that my family is helping so much. Now, you do family history. Tell us about your favourite ancestor or tell us about a black sheep. Tell us about someone interesting. Well, I wouldn't say that there are no black sheep, but... Um, someone interesting. Just, well, I mean, my, my grandfather actually uh, yeah. is, is... Well, that was the oldest I got in my family at yes. that time from, from the vice leader. side. So maybe he's my hero, but not the hero of the understanding that everything he did was just great. I mean, he was my grandfather, yep. and this is enough for That's me to, yes. to, to, to describe him or declare mm -hmm. him as being my hero. Mm -hmm. So, uh, well, my interest is to find out how the people actually lived. I mean, mm -hmm. I know the Americans history? might... Pardon? Yeah, the social, social history. How I they mean, fit in. I, mean yeah. I know that the Americans might have someone coming from the Mayflower ship, but yeah. the ship actually wasn't that big so that everyone could be on board there. But <laughs> I, I, don't, I don't look after big kings or big heroes in history. I just take them as they have been, they as individuals yes. and being interesting for me. Mm. And so... Probably one last question for you, Dirk. Have you done a DNA test? No, I didn't. No, do I didn't. Do you think um, you might do one? Well, I have had wonderful, wonderful uh, discussions on that. I, I haven't made up You're my mind sure yet. yet. Yeah, maybe um, I will be. Your European persuaded. reserve. You can say so. Yes, well, maybe. Well, do you know what? I have been so lucky that you haven't been reserved during this interview. So, Dirk, thank, thank you so much for chatting with Joe, me. Joe, thank you very, very much for giving me that honour. Telling and me about thank you. you. Thank you. Thank you.